Hey, hey nerds. nerds! Can you guess what time it is? It's unboxing time. It's triangle time! Yes. This, this is the most uh, creatively oh, designed. Oh, you notice our box is kind of defective. Um, it's defective well, because a little chip. we pre-ordered it, but they pre-ordered The Last Guardian twice versus putting money down in this game. And we didn't pay attention to it until it was right before the game was about to come out. We're like, but we, but what? And so they looked for it and they're like, okay, so we couldn't technically sell this one, but we can give it to you guys. And it's like, yay! Thank you. We love you. Anyway. anyway, so uh, Mankind uh, Divided, Day Sex. Didn't think this game was gonna come in this form. Sorry, I didn't mean the triangle, I mean. Um, this point, spoilers, sorry. He apparently died at the end of the last game, but obviously he's the protagonist of this one, so he's totally not dead. So. Well, he only died depending on which ending you chose. So. He actually dies in every ending. He dies in all four endings. There's a fifth ending. But you know, when you're a cyborg on the run, sometimes you gotta fake your own death so you can have another story about you. Hey, for once, I'm not the one struggling with the. Shut up. <laughs> I'm not really struggling, it's just. It's not as bad as King of Fighters was. Oh, fuck King of Fighters. I'll fuck your King of Fighters. Eventually, we're totally gonna get a PlayStation 4. Before the end of the year. But I mean, if you don't already know, I hope you do. Um, there's about to be a price drop because they're about to uh, announce the Slum PS4 and the PS4 Neo. So you best believe we're about to be gaming so hard. Alright, let's see what's going down. It's like I tried. Do you need help there? No. Just don't tear the triangle. There we go. Uh, uh, oh shit. <laughs> um, That's what you get. Okay. Okay. Wait. Me. Okay. So I'm just gonna put some down. Cause fuck this shit. Hey, you wanna see the inside of the box? Sorta, kinda. Well, oh my god, are you about to tear the box? No, I'm not about to tear the box, but the outside box isn't the important part of the box. Oh, okay, so if you want to see the inside, boom. This is just the outer cardboard. Hey. Then, this is the inside. Obviously, it's missing some things. Um, that's the top part. And, for your display purposes, I like the golden trim they got going on. The golden trim they got going on is perfect. Oh, it's supposed to be like that. It doesn't yeah. close all the way because it has that gold line. Yeah. It's like, oh, look at that. It's it's like a piece of art. It actually kind of looks like a PlayStation. It does. Anyway. On that note, let's see what goodies we got here. No, I'm going to show the goodies. Okay. So it comes with, pull it off. This Adam Jensen figure. This is what you guys missed. Uh, yeah, so the main character is a game. I don't know is, if this little crusty stuff is... This is the first statue we've gotten. Yeah, but there's also a statue for the Last Guardian Special Edition, so... Feel that. So, um, I guess this part comes off? It has to. There we go. Oh, so he's running. Yeah, can we put that back on him? Yeah. Oh, but... Oh my god, wait. We gotta show him his butt. His butt is just so spiky. Spiky. Like, that is the most spiky ass ever. Spiky butt. Um, they did put a lot of detail into him. I hope so. So... I don't know if that's I kind mean, of like a stylistic thing, all the uh, like polygons. I would never actually buy him. It's gotta be. It's because of the augmentation. 
No, I mean, like, literally, like, a stylistic thing as opposed to, like, literally, this is what he looks like in-game. Mm. Is what I'm saying. I mean, maybe. I guess we'll find out when we play it eventually. All right, on to the next piece. Da -da 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 -da. A book. This is an art book. It's a design work, is what it says. Emptiness. Wait. And then we have... The triangles. Game of triangles. Oh, it's like Zelda. It's like three Zeldas. Sorry, three Triforces. Then words from people who made it. It looks like it was made from a multicultural uh, team who had different beliefs, but is an Assassin's Creed. Okay, so we have shit characters, <laughs> weapons, faces, this discount is Morgan Jim Freeman. Miller. Uh, okay, these are just characters. Do you got something interesting for me? Uh, characters this is probably a boss or something. Environments. Yay. Whoa, wait, wait. Environments. Wait, I'm actually just show some of these environments. Oh, the depth of field in that picture is pretty great. I don't mean, concept, concept art is great. Okay, right, let's, let's skip ahead. Then we got augmentations. Let's skip a little bit more, and then we have the end, because we're not going to show you every page of the book. We damn near did, though. Yeah. Again. Alright, uh, now for the moment you've been waiting for. The steel book case. Oh, the steel book case. Well, that's all the time we have in there. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> very shiny finish. Obviously, um, they, sorry, in the last game they were making, um, all the, all the images of, like, a. Like pr uh, promotional art had things kind of uh, equating the characters to um, Icarus flying too high into the sun with their ambitions of robotic augmentation. And this one, uh, I guess he's an angel or Jesus. One of them. Oh, look, it doesn't have a book, but it does have some uh, some DLC there. Um, this is extra digital content. I'm not sure if this is the same thing as the day one edition, but it does seem to be a lot of stuff. So. Let's see. Um, oh, he's showing like, all our codes. Wait, it's different. No one watches our videos. Um, wait, is this in Spanish? Part of this is in Spanish. Yeah, it's multicultural. Hey, look, Rise of the Foom Bader. Oh, yeah. So it's going to be, if you didn't already know, it's not technically Xbox exclusive. Rise of Tomb Raider is coming out this year for PS4. Alright, and then if we oh, October. go back here, more triangles. Triangles are the way of the world. Can you take the disc out? I'll take your disc out. Having a little bit hard time though with my disc now, aren't you? Yeah, well, I mean, I haven't disc you in a while. So, long story short, this is uh, Triangles Human Re uh something. Revolution. It's a first person RPG. Mankind divided with triangles. I wonder how much racism will be in this game. Always. A ton. Racism is part of Deus Ex's culture. Well, it's just the last game took place in um in Detroit. Which All is right, why. Alright, nerds. Alright. Just one last pick of the bots and just can get a top view. Triangles everywhere. It's been fun. PCs. Tuna Leasties.